Wow, guys, this is awesome. They're having a bunch of Jurassic Park packs. And here says, can you fight the Jurassic Park's most dangerous dinosaur back into containment? The T-Rex escape. And we are going to fight him. So let's go ahead. So first of all, we have three T-Rexes we've got to beat. Okay, I'm going to use the Carnaraptor, Raptor, Mastontosaurus, and Metaposaurus. Cool. So, start off. Always build up your reserve, guys. It's the best way. So, just let him keep attacking. I will keep on building up my reserve. This guy, that's fine. I've got my two aquatics. Same thing. Four in reserve. Oh, attack. Oh, almost killed him. He wasn't even trying. Okay, so he attacked four. He wasn't making fun. Totally defenseless. One hit will take this guy down. So one hit. Four in reserve. Three in block. Bam, it's down. over. Cool. <sighs> okay. Wanted to go more fair, but uh, I don't care. Pulosaurus, <laughs> mean Dagosaurus. <laughs> Reserve. I mean, there's not really much of a challenge. I think they're trying to make it easy so anybody could. Celebrate the anniversary of Jurassic Park. Twenty-fifth anniversary this year. <laughs> okay, I got four. Let's just put him out of his misery. And battle two is down. We're gonna jump right into battle number three. Cool. Okay, uh, nice and easy. Uh, let's go press the Sucus. One in reserve. Way too easy. Their card pack must be not too special. I don't even know if they would have a T Rex in the card pack. It was so easy. Okay, T Rex escape pack. That is so cool. Look at that. <laughs> 
See, Jurassic Park 25th anniversary. Awesome. Oh, it does have a T Rex. Pretty sweet. Okay. Okay, this one says Raptors on the Prowl. This one's Elasmotherium. I don't really, I don't know, I don't, I don't really like the aquatic battles, to tell you the truth. Gyrosphere victory there. PvP. Okay, so, uh, looks like we got some more VIP battles. So this one I will go ahead and do. So we've got the Prior Trodon, Indominus, and T-Rex, all carnivores. Okay, so Ichthyostega, Tanny Caligrius, and Prionosuchus. Nice and simple. One in reserve. Once again, build up the reserve, guys. We're going to win a lot of battles doing that. Three in reserve. See, the guy wasted two blocking. Now he's dead. Too late. And he's defenseless now, so I should be able to take him down with a hit of two. And I'll put four in reserve. And this battle's pretty much over. He's down. All carnivores. Down this Rex level eight. That's pretty low level. I got mine up to level four. Okay, so he's good to be down, but he is defenseless. Back of three, I believe he's going to be down. Yep. And four in reserve. Down he goes. T-Rex, level 39. Battle one is in the bag. We're gonna jump right into battle number two. And battle number two, we got a herbivore, aquatic, and pterosaur. So uh you wanna go by the class system. So herbivore, you're gonna wanna have a uh, carnivore. I usually like to keep it pretty close. Aquatic, you're going to want a pterosaur. Pterosaur, you're going to want an herbivore. Uh, okay. And start. Again, one Attacking me, I could have switched to aquatic, but hey, make my work easier. Attack a two, one in reserve. This guy probably Yep. Which is fine. He's defenseless. My pterosaur will take him right down. He's only got one left. And this battle is so he could only get one. And battle two is the bad. Battle number three. Okay, so we've got two carnivores and an herbivore. So for the carnivores, you're going to want to use aquatic, which oh, I don't really have. I'm going to use 
my Herbosaurus. I'm gonna use my Aquatic for the second Carnivore and for the Herbivore. Uh, Spinal Raptor's a little overpowering, but yeah, I'll use the Spinal Raptor. Oh, what happened here? Uh, okay. Aquatic. Actually, let's go something a little stronger there. And, oh, you know, I was going to use the Ostoposaurus. That's right. Okay. So, Ostoposaurus and Stegosaurus. Oh, nope. Wrap. Okay, one in reserve. He's not gonna kill me with two hits. He could come pretty fast. That's alright. Okay, same thing. I'm gonna put three in reserve. He's got three. He could kill me. He's got two left. Now let's take him down. Attack of uh, four will get him. He's got two left. So I'm just going to attack six. Two, but he's still down. So next guy will probably wipe me out. And I'll get him with my aquatic. So this guy's got three. Attack two. We'll have one left. Attack of two will take him. Let your mind wander for a minute and miss everything. Okay, so that was the third battle. Two left to go to get my legendary pack. Okay, so herbivore, you're gonna want to match it with the carnivore. Two aquatics. I'm going to get a pterodactylus and a stronger pterodactylus. First thing you want to do is put one in reserve. Okay, this guy can only attack me one. Leaving himself. I'm gonna attack two, I might not get it's going to be close. Oh, I did this. Oh, that stinks. That really stunk. Okay, so here I'm just going to put three in reserve. If they kill me, that's all right. I got my other more powerful Pterodactylus. Yes, we did. We'll get this guy pretty easy. Two, four in reserve, one in block. Okay, he is still good. Probably gonna kill me. So he's got one left to block. I should have seven. Okay. okay. So attack of two will take him down. He's got one left to block. I will put four into reserve. One block. Oh, I should have blocked. Him. 
if this guy's got, oh, see, he's got five. Oh, if he had ten, oh, he's got me. Oh, that's a thing. Okay. Well, that's what happens when you get <sighs> two comes. Okay, well, battle number four again. So, Tani Caligrius, I do need my pterodactylus back. Uh, what else? Like, uh, okay, I'm going to match him with the herbivore and pterodactylus for the last so, one in reserve. See, that's why I lost the last battle. I did not build up my reserve enough. Which I should. Okay, so here I will bring in my herbivore and the two in reserve. Guy wants to kill me. Go ahead, kill me. Got five. I will put four into reserve. One into block. So three will take him down, three in reserve. Bam! Down he goes. Bring in my deck list and take care of business. Make a six, block two, He is mine. <laughs> okay, jump right into the fifth battle and collect our legendary pack. Okay, so the first one we got is Aquatic. Pterosaur Carnivore. I will need my Pterodactylus back for the Aquatic. For the Pterosaur... You know, I'm going to meet him brute force with my Indominus. For the Priotrodon, I will need the Mistontosaurus. Sweet. 
one more. He's got four. Okay, so I got the legendary. The bad thing about these legendary packs, they don't have money anymore. Good point. They don't have dollars anymore. Okay, got more put on. I guess. At least they get a good amount of VIP points. And that's about all the battles I could do now that I'm interested in. Uh, I am maxed out on meat. 99 million coins. I am almost maxed out. I'm maxed out, so I don't need to do that. Uh, DNA. This is where you want to go off. You want to, you always try to get maximum tickets. You could get 10 of these, you get a better price, and then always watch the videos. And then I always check the ship too if they have anything good for trading. Which I'm not seeing anything. Okay, well that's gonna be it for right now. Welcome to WT Toys. Have fun. guys we're gonna continue the Jurassic Park packs you could buy a Jurassic Park forever pack or what we're gonna do now is defeat a pair of Jurassic Park velociraptors it says fight or the best rewards are yet to come get your t-rex and raptors for the final showdown okay let's go ahead and fight so here we are going to move to this Twin Raptors Pack, Jurassic Park 25th Anniversary Edition. Awesome. So we got to fight two raptors. So I'm going to use a Soprano Titan and an Ichthyostega for the first battle. So these Jurassic Park 25th Anniversary Packs are really awesome. Uh, one in reserve. Always build up your reserve. You're gonna win the majority of your battles. Okay, so he almost killed him, but down there. So attack of three, bam, down. Next one is coming up against my aquatic, so he doesn't have much of a chance at all. Which is fine, means he's got one left. I only need to hit him twice. And I got three, so this battle's over. Awesome. 
so that was a short and sweet first battle. Gonna jump right into the second. 50 DNA. Okay, so the second one again. Two raptors. So let's see. Ah, hmm. Let's go with. Okay, I'm gonna go with Carnal Raptor and uh, Sarcosuchus. I'll put one in reserve. Probably. Yeah. Okay, that's alright. I will put my reserve on. So I will put three in reserve. We'll probably attack. Oh, okay. okay, so this guy's being sneaky. <laughs> I'm have a hard time here. Let's see. I will attack for uh I think I'm blocked too. Left that means he is doomed. Doom, doom, doom. Bam, down he goes. So second battle was just as easy as the first one. And third battle is. <laughs> I guess it does say twin raptors, so sort of gotta expect that, right? Okay, so this one I'm going to go with an... Oh. Let's go with the Prestosuchus and then the Stontosaurus. We might not win it, but we will see. Okay, this back too. Is defenseless, an attack of two would take him down and pull one in reserve. Down he goes, one more to go. So the next guy will get him easily. Down, down, skid. Okay, card pack. Like I said, sweet and easy. But I love the look of it. It says Twin Raptors Pack, Jurassic Park 25th Anniversary. So, okay. So, you do get Twin Raptors. <laughs> I guess it's in the name. Right? I don't think I had any other battles I wanted to do right now. But I wanted to show you guys some cool stuff. Here, my uh, second Erliposaurus just hatched. So, I can go ahead and combine these two and get this guy up to like level 18. These are not cheap, but he's going to be quite powerful. So that's taking a lot of cash, which I don't have much cash. Oh, okay. Third time. That's not too bad. So, Erlinosaurus. Wow, level 11. He's already at 3,400. is 4,371 health, 1,000 in attack. And if you go, well, let's turn the reward. If you go to Evo 4, 9,960, that is crazy. If you look at uh, 
Let's just jump in here. I'll show you my most powerful. Oh, I would have to go to a battle stage. If I did fight, you could see he's only number two to the Indominus Rex, which is at level 40. So at level 19, he's my second strongest dinosaur. That is crazy. And then I'm going to go ahead and I have to get another one to hatch here. Like I showed you guys uh, earlier, I have a lot of these guys to hatch. I mean, just here, a lot of the uh, legendary. Just here, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 18, 18 legendary I have to hatch. And then I got some legendary here in the aquatic that I need to hatch. Looks like four, five, five legendary in the aquatic. And I got a legendary dinotherium over there. So, I got a lot of dinos to hatch, which here I'm just going to pick probably the first legendary one that comes up, which is Ictiotega. So, I, without a lot of cash, I can't hatch all of these. I mean, I don't have the resources. Uh, you can see I'm pretty much maxed out on money, just about on food. So I'll get the factory going again. Okay. This is something you want to do. See here where it says claim? Always come in here. Uh, uh, I'll show you what I do. Right now I'm going to claim it. Okay, that one's not that good. But I've got a lot of good dinos in here, guys. Just doing that stuff. Here, claim it. Okay. And lots of DNA. Okay, so there I get a rare. Uh, go over here. Always, if you have VIP points, don't spend them on card packs. Come here. Legendary. You click that plus there and buy the maximum. It's cheaper and it also triggers this thing here where you could get... I've got so many really cool dinosaurs here. Like here I just got a legendary banana genius. So I got a lot of legendary ones there. And if you could afford it, uh, max out. So here I got a super rare. Uh, this is DNA, so I got plenty of DNA. So I will buy times 10 twice. And then always watch the videos and you'll get more uh, stuff here. I just don't want to start a video because I'm not done yet. And then uh, I don't need... Uh, I guess I could gather some... 99,999,999 is the max. Once you get up there, you're done. And then always go here to the trader because sometimes you could trade for some really good resources here. Okay, this time it's not all that great because I'm not trading DNA. Well, DNA for cash. Yeah, at that time I will. Usually I don't trade my DNA, but I really need cash right now. And then food for DNA, definitely. Because food I could get easily and I'm not using right now. So make sure my food factory, okay, food factory is out 23 hours. Okay, so that was awesome.
And today's secret word is the word... Go ahead and put that in the comment section down below the video. I'll know you're a member of my club. Click the subscribe button below for a lot more fun videos. Also, click the bell button to be notified every time I make a new video. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos. And if you want to see even more, go ahead and click the subscribe button.